Therefore hear, you nations, and know, O congregation, what is upon them. Judgment is coming upon them. Hear, O earth, see, I am bringing evil upon this people, even the fruit of their thoughts, because they have not listened to my words, nor my Torah, and they rejected it. And so judgment came upon Yehudah because they refused to ask for the ancient paths and find the good way and walk in it. Let's go over to Jeremiah chapter 18 and we'll read a little bit further on this. Jeremiah chapter 18 beginning with verse 11 it says, And now speak to the men of Yehudah and to the inhabitants of Jerusalem, saying, Thus said Yah, See, I am forming evil and devising a plan against you. Return now every one from his evil way, and make your ways and your deeds good. He's giving them another opportunity to turn back to him and follow his ways of Torah. But they shall say, It is no use. No use for you to say these things to us. We're not listening. For we walk according to our own plans. And we do each one the stubbornness of his evil heart. We're not going to follow in your ways. We're going to do what we want to do. Therefore, thus said Yah, ask now among the nations who has heard the like of this. The maiden of Israel has done what is most horrible. Does the snow of Lebanon cease from the rock of the field? Or the cool flowing waters from afar dry up? But my people have forgotten me. They have burned incense to what is false. And they have stumbled from their ways, from the ancient paths. To walk in bypaths and not on a highway. To make their land become a ruin, a hissing forever. Everyone who passes by it is appalled and shakes his head. I shall scatter them as with an east wind before the enemy. I shall show them the back and not the face in the day of their calamity. And so Yehudah would not listen. Yehudah wanted to do what Yehudah wanted to do and was stubborn and resistant. And because of that, judgment came upon them. They refused to walk in the ancient paths where the good way is. And because of that, judgment came upon them. They refused to walk in the ways of Yah. They refused to walk in the culture defined by Torah, the way of living, the way of life. They didn't want it. They wanted their own way. They wanted the ways of the world. They wanted the ways of mixed up religion. They wanted the ways of modern culture, so to speak. They chose a different way, a different path, and they were judged because of it. So, we're going to ask the question today, what paths are we choosing? Even as believers in Yeshua, are we still hanging on to mixed up religion? Are we still hanging on to the world? Are we allowing modern culture to shape our thoughts and our behaviors? Or have we decided that we want to be defined by Torah? and walk in the ways of Elohim. 